okay, we have a binomial distribution here. Someone's going to shoot 100 free throws. And they have an 80% success rate. They make 80% of the free throws. Um, and we're going to talk about the probability that this person makes exactly 80 of the 100 free throws. So we have a binomial distribution. Either the person makes the basket or doesn't make it. So let's look at this with the TI-83 or TI-84. The first button I'm going to turn my calculator on, of course. The first button I'm going to go to is this distribution button above the bars button. Second distribution. And I'm going to scroll down to binome PDF. I'm going to hit enter. And I'm going to start out with the number of trials. 100 trials. I put a comma. Then we're going to talk about the probability of success, which was 80%. Okay, 0.8 comma, and then I'm going to talk about the number of successes we were talking about. We said the probability that that person would make exactly 80 free throws. So I'm going to put 80. And the answer is 0 0.099, so about 10%. Now, we're going to ask, talk about the probability of making at most 80 baskets. All right? So that's going to be the cumulative distribution function. Make at most 80. That would be 0, that the probability of the person makes 0, or 1, or 2, or 3, or 4, et cetera, et cetera, all the way up to 80 free throws. So we're going to get a probability higher than this. But to do this, I'm going to go back to distribution. I'm going to go down to the cumulative. This is binome CDF. I'll hit enter. 100 trials, comma, probability of 0.8, comma, 80. This means, everyone, just make sure you understand this. This C is cumulative, meaning probability of making 0 or 1 or 2 or 3 all the way up to 80. This should be pretty high. Let's see what we get. All right. 0.539, about... 54%. And lastly, let's talk about the probability that someone makes more than 80 free throws. This person who has an 80% success rate, what's the probability if they have 100 shots, take 100 shots, 100 trials, the probability they make more than 80. Well, since this was at most 80 baskets, we can just simply take 100% or 1.0 and subtract that last answer. And we get 46%. All done.